So today I've had a really lovely day um, with friends. There were supposed to be six of us gathered. Uh, however, two couldn't make it. And one of the reasons we were meeting was not just because of friendship, but my friend uh, who was hosting it is possibly moving house. And she wanted to do a little ceremony in her home before uh, the likelihood of her having to leave took place. So she asked me if I would do a dispatcho ceremony. Now a dispatcho uh, is, is essentially a prayer bundle. It comes from the Peruvian tradition. Uh, a dispatcho is an offering which is made at um, say a full moon, a new moon, a harvest time, uh, equinox, solstices, any time when people wish to give thanks or give prayers for. It's very much about working with the natural world and the natural cycles. It's a way of giving thanks to Pachamama or Mother Earth for all that she provides. It's a way also of sending out prayers to our loved ones, to the earth, um, to situations that may need uh, prayers, love, healing. So it's a, it's a very loving thing to do and we did it today on the new moon as well. So it's, it's about ceremony and ritual and coming back into connection with each other and um, our, our natural world. So uh, what, two of the women hadn't done it before and uh, quite often when I've done it in the past, we stand up. But today, for some reason, we sat down around the table and it evolved into something really quite different this time. It was like how women might have gathered in the old days and did patchwork and told their stories and wrote their stories into the patchwork. And it had that kind of flavor, that kind of sense of each woman opening up and telling a little bit about herself. And um, one woman in particular, who's our very dear friend, has a situation with her granddaughter who could be very ill. And she hadn't told us, but through this process, she was able to talk to us about it and put her prayers into this for her, um, her granddaughter. And then we were able to offer our prayers for the granddaughter too. So after we've completed, so the sort of things that we put in, you put in flowers and seeds, sweets, uh, we, we draw in it, and we try and put only things that are biodegradable. And on this occasion, we burnt the dispatcho. You can actually put it in the ground and then that's a very slow process of releasing the healing and the prayers. But we decided today that we were going for new beginnings and we wanted things to move quite quickly. This is the season, spring of happening and things starting to move forward. Uh, so we decided we would put it on the fire. So we built a fire outside. Um, we, we, you, you fold it all up, tie it all up, and then we placed it on the fire. And, uh, and then you walk away and leave it. So there's no attachment to the outcome. And as it happened, I actually put in, I, 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 I just put a prayer in for something new to happen in my life that would be like a new project, or something that would inspire me, something creative, something different that would, to some extent, balance out a lot of the SFM work as well, that would give me a bit more fun and, and, and um, lightheartedness and uh, something more playful. And I just not within one hour, and this is honestly one hour, hour I had a, uh, a call from a friend who asked me if I, I would drum and sing on her new album. I was absolutely gobsmacked. So the kind of, she does uh, new age spiritual music so the kind of singing will be chanting but she wanted my chanting with 
my drum. So I'm absolutely delighted and over the moon and excited and I can't wait for that, that to, uh, to start. So this afternoon was such a, a creative afternoon spent with friends, um, really connecting and, and listening to each other. I hope you've all had a great weekend and all the best.